Hey guys, it's Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm here to present to you the 2017 V Gary Dean Wash Method. Now, there's a lot of people on the internet talking about things they don't know about, but what I do know is that in 2012, 2012, five years ago, I released the Gary Dean Wash Method. Now the biggest benefit to that over a traditional rinseless wash is that you're not reintroducing old dirt that came off the car back into the wash bucket at all. And so with the pre-soak, which encapsulates the dirt, lifts it off the surface so that there's less chance when you go by the dirt with the towel of inducing marring into the paint, creating swirl marks. Now, you guys already know if you've watched any of my videos, if you've been following me for a while or any time at all, that I'm not a swirl Nazi. I don't really worry about swirls per se. I do everything I can to prevent them per se, but if I get some swirls, it's not a huge end of the world. I, I don't, I just don't feel like spending a ton of my life worrying about that. There are other things in life I worry about swirl marks just aren't one and so when it comes to the gary dean wash method i didn't invent anything all i did was put a series of events in order to create the way that i wash hence the gary dean wash method now there are other people on the internet saying that they came up with it saying that they have put together their own thing their own wash method that's fine but the series of events, the sequence of events, if you will, in the Gary Dean wash method that I'm going to show you right now is the absolute best way, and there is no better way to prevent swirl marks other than not touching the paint at all. So, I had the Infinite Use Detail Juice in the brand new 8 ounce size. I also have some pre-diluted infinite use detail juice in this empty well in this spray bottle so turn that on spray I'm going to put one quarter of an ounce which is one cap full of the infinite use detail juice in this empty bucket okay that is all that you need one quarter of an ounce for one wash. So I'm going to use one gallon of water. We'll go ahead and sit that there. I'm going to use one gallon of tap water. Distilled water, which is on the label, is cleaner water than tap water and because it has fewer minerals uh, that like to attack the polymers in a lot of products, um, because uh, distilled has fewer minerals, uh, you'll get a slicker finish with distilled, but it's marginal and realistically not a big deal. Just use tap water for your dilutions, for your wash water, for all of that is totally fine. So with that quarter of an ounce of product, I'm gonna add in one gallon of water into this bucket. This is my 2016 Ford F-150. One gallon of water, all you need to wash a big old truck like this. So, I've got another bucket. The reason for this bucket is to take the towels that I discard. So after I use them, I will move them into this bucket so that I don't reintroduce the dirt that came off the truck back into the clean wash water. You never put that dirt back into the wash water. That wash water bucket never gets contaminated at all. So in this bucket, I've got my Gary Dean wash method drying towel, which I sell on detailjuice.com. I also have six green all-purpose towels. For this demonstration, what you'd normally do is you'd pre-soak all your towels in that gallon of water. And that gallon really will do two vehicles. But what I like to use the rest of the water after I've done the body uh, for is the wheels. 
and that extra water really gives you a chance to deep clean your wheels, especially if they're pretty dirty. So for this demonstration, I'm going to go ahead and pre-soak all of these towels that I'm going to wash my truck with into that one gallon of water. There you go. Got them all in there. Soak them down. Get them all soaking wet. Make sure they're all thoroughly soaked. Now, this is how the Gary Dean wash method goes. You've got your pre-mixed product. This gets mixed at two and a half ounces in a gallon of water, or it's like 0.62 of a uh, of an ounce. I put a half an ounce in here, which is going to be two capfuls, and fill it up with water. That's plenty for the pre-soak. That's me right there saving you on product. So pre-soak a panel for this demo. We're going to do just this uh, rear passenger door. Pre-soak. Use the pre-soak liberally. I've done another video recently where I explain that you don't have to do this pre-soak. This pre-soak was designed to do a lot of the work for you in preventing, helping you to prevent uh, more swirls than you need to put in, which, and that's subjective on uh, even using that terminology. Anyway, the pre-soak helps. Do you have to do it? No. Does it help with uh, minimizing swirls? Absolutely. This is chemically surrounding the dirt and lifting it off the surface so that when I walk by or when I go by with a swipe of a clean towel just like this I'm going to put in fewer swirl marks than I would if I didn't pre-soak. So with that pre-soak there I go from top to bottom just like this now I've done about half, so I did the top half. I'm gonna flip over the towel now, always using a clean side. Side to side motion, overlapping about 20%, and there you go. You can see all the dirt on the towel. None of that will ever see that paint again until this towel gets washed. So. I've used two sides of this towel. Now I can flip it over. There's plenty of, of the solution left in this towel to go ahead and do the next panel. Uh, however, I'm just going to sit it to the side because now this whole door has been washed. And now I'm going to take the Gary Dean wash method drying towel, fold it over a couple of times, and I'm going to dry just like I washed from top to bottom. Just like that. Super clean, super shiny, and all done. It's not complicated, but it is the absolute best way without question to get the best results when you're rinseless washing and the best way to ensure that you're putting as few scratches in the paint as possible. And that's the 2017 Gary Dean wash method. I can tell you that from that 2012 video that I shot in 2012, March of 2012, I actually watched that again this morning. I wanted to really think about if I could improve this in any way. The only difference that has even come about in the last five years with the Gary Dean wash method has been the addition of this 16 by 24 waffle weave drying towel. Now in 2012 I was using three separate 16 by 16 uh, 300 gram uh, per square inch or per square meter so GSM uh, all-purpose towels. So the first one was to wash, the second was a damp towel to dry, and then the third one was to buff off the residue. I have since realized, and that's why in, I believe, 13, I went to the bigger 
waffle weave drying towel. I have since gone to an even smaller one because you don't need all of that size. That's extra cost and extra bulk in your rig. Uh, this is all you need. So anyway, this is really the only solid addition or even change is just the amount of towels that I use and I can get this whole truck done with about six to seven towels depending on how thorough I want to be. Um, I'm going to do it with six towels. I'm going to get the wheels clean and everything. Uh, and then I'm going to use one of these waffle weave drying towels. That's it. It's not complicated. And like I said, the structure, the basis for this wash method was multiple towels in a bucket. When I shot that original video, before I put my name on anything, I did tons of research. And, you know, I guess I don't really care if somebody else calls it their own. Call it whatever you want. Call it a black puppy. I don't care what you call it. It is what it is. This is the best way to rinse and wash your car, period. If you guys got questions for me, 813-846-4406. That's my cell phone number. Call it. You will find that out. Uh, if I don't answer the phone, leave me a voicemail. I'll get back to you as soon as I can or send me a text message. Uh, if you don't use the number, I can't help you. I'm more than willing to help with anything I can uh, to help you with your detailing endeavors. Check out DetailJuice.com for the Infinite Use Detail Juice and all the new stuff that I got going on. I'm super pumped to release these new products. The brand new Grip Launch line will be out most likely the spring of 2018. I also have the Gary Dean Signature Series line, which is three products, uh, one of which is a very potent, uh, very protective rinseless wash, forever rinseless. Uh, I've got a very, very strong tire gel, tough tire gel, very weatherproof. It works awesome, lasts a good long while. Uh, it's not slimy or snotty. Uh, and then I've got a very fantastic cleaner that's actually stronger than the Infinite Purpose Cleaner. So if you guys use that, you know what that's about. It's actually amazing. But this new brand new everything antimicrobial cleaner will also kill bacteria and germs, which the IPC, I guess the reality is it does that, but because it doesn't have this other ingredient in it, we can't officially say it so the brand new everything cleaner will absolutely be everything that you need to clean inside and outside all three products one line getting back to my roots if you guys got questions let me know check out gary dean's detail juice nation it's a group on facebook where we talk about only my products my processes and what i've got going on thanks guys for watching my videos have a wonderful day